Kefren Turam UCL road to the knockouts requires two squad completions, one being an 84 and a team of the week and also just an 85 with one France player around uh, 50k for this SBC. Again, pretty cheap. Um, I think it's a really good SBC to do, to be fair. He is six or four in height. He has a acceleration type of control with three star skill moves and three star weak foot with his preferred foot being right. Player details, he can play centimid and CDM positioning for Serie A and also Juventus with the nationality being France, of course. These are the attributes, 80 pace, 81 shooting, 81 passing, 84 dribbling with 83 defending and 85 physical profile. As this is a live card, he can get upgraded. I'm unsure how Juventus are currently doing in the UCL at the moment in the new league format. Um, but I think they are due to probably going to get an upgrade on this card, if I'm completely honest. An 85 rated and can also be chucked into an Evo as well. So again, a decent card. 50k is not too much as well for it. He has six play styles, pinged. Ping, playstyle, intercept, bruiser, press proven, flare, and relentless. No playstyle pluses on this card. So, again, it could be eligible for an Evo down the line if EA ever decides to release one for this card or whatever we need to put him into. For the rolls, he gets a CDM of holding plus. And for the center mid position, he gets a box to box plus. No plus plus rolls on this card. So, you get CDM of holding and a center mid of box to box. We finished the 84 squad. We are about to finish the 85 rated squad. I'm going to submit right now and let's get him into the club. I don't believe he walks out. <clears throat> Excuse me. Even though it shows him in the tunnel, there he is. He doesn't actually walk out of the tunnel, unfortunately. But yes, there is our Kefren Taram. Welcome to the club. He does get controlled lengthy with either an anchor, a backbone, a hawk, a marksman, or a sentinel on the card so we're probably going to go ahead and try some different play styles out on him if i'm completely honest again if you guys have play styles that you want to put on the card then feel free let me just quickly go ahead and remove and then add him to the squad there he is very very nice indeed i will be going ahead and putting a probably i'm gonna try a backbone on him first um just to see, because that gets passing, defending, and physical up, which also gets him controlled lengthy. Again, you can put an anchor on him, which will give him boosts in pace, defending, and physical if you really want to. But we are just going to go with a backbone for now and just try out a bunch of different play styles on him. But we did get Division 2, so let's jump into some games. First game in Division 2. Let's see how it goes. Again, we are just trying to see how good Taram is in the midfield area. Um... I didn't actually sort out the team management for him, I believe. But he is holding as a CDM. But we will quickly change that right now. We'll put him as a box-to-box -box on balanced. Just to see what he can do. And then keep the rest as it is. Like, we need to see his defensive and attacking capabilities, I feel like. But again, it all depends on what formation you run him in. He just got a weird that was that was a weird speed boost there. I mean good strength and good acceleration to get away there. And just draws a foul in, which is very nice. Good strength and acceleration. Unlucky. Still got the ball through there. Good layoff. Good ball to uh, start up with the attack. And that's Brolin on the uh, on the on the finesse there with the technical plus. Very nice. All came from uh, Turan winning the ball in the midfield. You love to see it as well. Unlucky we didn't win the ball, but it's all good. Good strength. Okay. Even as a CDM. Okay. <laughs> okay. That's it. That's crazy. Crazy. We can get him on the run. If you can get him on that run to like get into the space, it's just unstoppable. Just the, the strength. Okay. Bit sloppy from us uh, at the end of the first half. Bit sloppy conceding three goals, but Turam 
good defensive awareness, good passing with the pinged regular play style, and also the strength to carry the ball forward and also get us a goal to make it 3-2 um, on the comeback. So we'll go into the second half now and see what we can do. Dude, just the strength, just the strength of Turam to carry the ball past the halfway line is absolutely crazy. We are using a backbone on him again just to make him a bit a bit more controlled lengthy. Where's Turam? Turam in the middle. Hold the ball. Lay off. Step over. Oh, Virgil. Just Virgil doing Virgil things. Big right. time on the ball, very nice. Nicely done, nicely done to ram into Bellingham, into the goal for Brolin. Very nice. Good win. Good composure by Turam in the middle. In the middle to Turam. Just carry the ball forward because he's just got so much strength. Green time. Oh, how's he saving that? Turam again in the middle. Space. Brolin. Brolin all the way. Lovely jubbly. Turam again in the middle. Body faint. Down bomb. Good distribution of the ball there. And again in the middle. Ah, oh, I turned the wrong way with him. It's my fault. Not the player's fault. Again in the middle. Just carry the ball because you've got so much power. Absolutely, just just get him into the stride, man. Just get him into the stride of running, and it's just GG's. What is that touch? Good interception by Turam there. Last ditch, man. Last ditch interception. Turam's on the ball. One, two. And away we go into the space. Oral. No, <laughs> always nice win to Ram. Nice win. I carried this out through to his brother. Come back over the top. My ball. That'll do. Breath. Nice. Taram's got space. Taram has all the space. Dude, the card's crazy. Dude, Turam, strength. Come on. I just need help. We have played our games with Turam. I did switch um, to an anchor chem style at the very last, and we did do a lot better with him with the plus on the um, pace and the defending and the physical. Um, overall, really good card for 50,000 coins or roughly, roughly about 50,000 coins on the SPC section. I would do it, honestly, in 84 and 85 raises squad. Fairly easy to get done. If you get your packs from squad battles, uh, rivals and champs games, if you play those as well. But again, player review. Yeah.
that was our Turam player review. Seven games played. Um, he's very fast in game on the ball. You can just charge for him. The strength on the cards absolutely insane. Um, just holds off majority of the players and good layoff for your players if they are around him. Um, hope you guys enjoyed this player review. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Thank you for watching. Peace out.